Welcome to Asana Solutions, YouTube's best place for everything related to Asana, process improvement, and project management. And today I want to talk to you about not necessarily Asana, but a tool that I use probably a billion times. Is that real? Maybe an overstatement. I use it a lot every single day. It's called Text Expander. And Text Expander honestly saves me hours of manual typing and retyping of the same things over and over again. The way that it works is you create snippets and you can share those across your team. They can be used on your mobile phone, on the browser, on your desktop, inside of your project management, inside of your CRM. And so I wanna show you what that looks like, how you can save time, how you can standardize your communications across your teams and different roles by using this one simple tool. We'll see you on the inside. I really probably shouldn't be doing this, but I'm gonna do it anyway. This is like my number one favorite tool, uh, as I said, and it's just something that I, I literally save hours and hours of time every single week by using this tool. It's called Text Expander, and so I'm gonna show you what it looks like. This is the dashboard, and if you do wanna open it up, um, you can open it up on the desktop and add team members and do a whole bunch of other configuration stuff, but I'm gonna show you just like the basics right here. So for me, what it does is it creates snippets for you that can be used on your mobile phone, across any browser, any tool, as long as it's installed on your desktop computer. And so for me, um, it helps me in, you know, creating emails. A lot of the times, you know, one that I will use a lot, let's actually go to the sales because these ones are the most commonly used ones. Um, I have these short codes. So something like, you know, someone books a call with me, right? And instead of, you know, writing them an email being like, hey, thanks for booking a call, you know, looking forward to catching up with you, you know, we have this right here. So it's literally dot hello. And then it says, hi, first name. Great to meet you. I'm looking forward to connecting and learning more about your company name. And you add that in there. Um, what does your availability look like? Here's my email or here's my calendar link to book some time, right? So I'm using these instead of typing out the same thing over and over every single time because I do receive a lot of referrals. I'm introduced to a lot of people. And so this was something that I was having to do over and over and over again. And because I use um, uh, Superhuman for my email, I just blanked there for a second. Um, I use this one so much. So I'm actually gonna show you what it looks like and so I'm gonna use the first one, hello, for a second. So I got this task up here inside of Asana, where else? And again, it all runs on short code. So if I type period, hello, it's gonna pop up with this little dialog window and I can say, hey, um, Michael, thanks for, you know, whatever. I'm looking forward to meeting you and learning more about Dunder Mifflin. Is that how you spell it? I-N, I can't remember. Anyways, um, there it is. And there's the email, right? Like, hey, Michael, great to meet you. Um, we're gonna get more about Dunder Mifflin. Here's my calendar link. And they can go there and they can book a connect call with me. So that is one of them that I use all of the time. Um, after we get off a connect call, I type in um, period about, and I'll show you what that one looks like. And what's nice about Text Expander is you can customize it. So there's quite a bit of information here. And so I can say, hi, Michael, um, like so. And if, you know, we'll put in the company name and um, if I want them to sign the NDA, but I'm, you know, it's our first time meeting, I don't want to overwhelm them. So I would uncheck that, for example. If we did book our Explore call, right, then I would keep that checked or I can uncheck it. And then if the Explore call was not booked, you know, or booked, you know, I can, you can pretty much customize it by having these on or off in any case. And then once we're done, we just press okay. And then it populates all the stuff that I wanted it to populate. And it has all the, the relevant links, uh, link to the NDA form, link to our resources and so on and so on. Another one that I really love is this one right here. It's called next steps, right? So this is after we've won a sale. 
Um, and there are times where I actually, I will customize this. It's not all templated. I will customize it depending on the conversations we've had, but this just saves me so much time and keeps me out of the weeds. So I can literally just plug and play. You can have drop downs in here because it says I've CC'd our project manager and I'm choosing from one of our three project managers, right? And then we can pull that in there and then they get their email. I'm CCing the project manager and so on and so on. So how you create these is you literally just click on the plus and it can be anything you want to. Um, I like it to be formatted text and pictures so we can use like bold and you know hyperlinks and things like that. But this could be, hi there, thanks for your time. Say you're at a networking event, right? It could be, thanks for your time, great meeting you the other day. As promised, here are those things I said I would send to you. Um, book a call here, and then we can put the link in, right? Just by highlighting it, putting our link to our calendar, whatever it may be. Now, what's the label gonna be? Um, this could be networking follow-up, right? Just so I can see what it looks like in my long list of things here. And the abbreviation, it could be network, right? So now, and it's instant, I don't have to do anything else. Now I just come over here, type in network and it automatically pops up exactly what that is so again you got a mobile phone you can install the text expander keyboard on your phone as well and you can do the exact same thing hyperlinks and all you can do it in hubspot you can do it i could open up notes on my computer and i can do it there because it's installed on my desktop it's not limited to just one tool there are a lot of tools out there that just have snippets that work for their tool this is not the case. Text Expander breaks down all those boundaries. It is cross-platform and it literally saves me hours and hours of time expanding these every single week. And what's nice too is I can edit the last, you know, expanded text. So if I do want to edit something, I can come in here and I can change it. Oh, there was a typo or I want to sound more excited, right? So I'm going to put an exclamation point now and then close it. And now it's updated. It's literally that simple. We have them for our operations. We have them for our marketing. We have them again for sales. And then I have my own private snippets that I use for um, other things. So I have like our business number here, our HST number, our corporate number, um, license agreements, my meeting link, right? Um, somebody what does want to meet with me. It's literally book M. Right? And let's see what this looks like. Feel free to use my calendar link to book a call. Like the amount of times I use this in a day by just typing book M, right? So check it out. Check out Text Expander. There's so much you can do with this. Hope you found this helpful. Um, and yeah, as always, if you have any questions, you know where to find me. Thanks for watching.